In a fast-paced and demanding world, it can be easy to neglect our own well-being. However, it is crucial that we prioritize self-care as it enables us to function at our best and achieve our goals. So, let us discuss how to take care of ourselves and lead a fulfilling life. Firstly, taking care of ourselves requires us to prioritize our physical health. Prioritizing our physical health is an essential component of self-care. By maintaining a healthy diet, engaging in regular exercise, and getting enough sleep, we can ensure that our bodies are functioning at their best. Our physical health affects not only our energy levels and overall well-being, but also our mental health. Taking care of our physical health can reduce the risk of developing chronic illnesses such as heart disease, diabetes, and obesity. It is important to make time for physical activity and healthy eating, even in our busy lives. By prioritizing our physical health, we can improve the quality of our life and be better equipped to handle life's challenges. As the famous quote by Lord Buddha goes, to keep body in good health is a duty. Otherwise, we shall not be able to keep our mind strong and clear. By eating a healthy diet, exercising regularly and getting enough sleep, we can maintain our physical health and ensure that our bodies are functioning at their best. Secondly, taking care of ourselves requires us to prioritize our mental health. Prioritizing our mental health is crucial for maintaining overall well-being. Our mental health affects how we think, feel, and behave. By practicing self-care activities such as mindfulness, meditation, and therapy, we can improve our mental health and reduce stress and anxiety. It is important to take time for ourselves and engage in activities that promote relaxation and positive thinking. By prioritizing our mental health, we can improve our relationships, increase our productivity, and lead more fulfilling lives. We should not hesitate to seek professional help when needed, as taking care of our mental health is just as important as taking care of our physical health. As the ancient Greek philosopher Aristotle said, happiness depends on ourselves. By practicing self-care activities such as meditation, journaling, and therapy, we can improve our mental health and reduce stress and anxiety. Thirdly, taking care of ourselves requires us to prioritize our personal and social relationships. Prioritizing our personal and social relationships is a key aspect of self-care. Our relationships with family, friends, and community play a vital role in our overall well-being. By investing in our relationships and nurturing our connections with others, we can feel supported, valued, and happy. It is important to make time for our loved ones and engage in activities that promote social interaction and communication. By prioritizing our personal and social relationships, we can improve our emotional health, reduce stress, and develop a sense of belonging. Maintaining healthy relationships requires effort, patience, and communication. By prioritizing our relationships, we can lead more fulfilling lives and enjoy the support and love of those around us. As the American author Maya Angelou said, I've learned that people will forget what you said. People will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made them feel. By investing in our relationships and nurturing our connections with others, we can feel supported and valued, which in turn improves our overall well-being. In addition to these strategies, taking care of ourselves also requires us to set boundaries, practice self-compassion, and engage in activities that bring us joy and fulfillment. As the writer and poet Rumi once said, your task is not to seek for love, but merely to seek and find all the barriers within yourself that you have built against it. By addressing the barriers to our own well-being and practicing self-care, we can lead more fulfilling and satisfying lives. In conclusion, taking care of ourselves is not a selfish act, but rather a necessary step towards achieving our goals and living a fulfilling life. By prioritizing our physical and mental health, investing in our relationships, practicing self-compassion, and engaging in activities that bring us joy, we can improve our overall well-being and achieve success. So let us always remember the words of an English poet, John Keats, who said, Nothing ever becomes real till it is experienced. 
Let us experience the fullness of our life by taking care of ourselves and those around us.